Intellectuals think or believe it as an act of biological warfare. Spirituals think or believe it as an act of God and read this as near times of apocalypse, doomsday or Armageddon. While scientists and virologists who are believers in science act on research and have termed as a disease outbreak. Monkeypox was named monkeypox because two outbreaks of diseases such as smallpox were first discovered in 1958 when they occurred in a colony of research monkeys. Trying to eradicate smallpox since then, monkeypox has been reported in humans in other Central and West African countries. Monkeypox is an extraordinary disorder this is due to contamination with monkeypox virus. Monkeypox virus belongs to the orthopox virus genus with inside the own circle of relatives poxviridae. The orthopox virus genus additionally consists of variola virus, which reasons smallpox, vaccinia virus, used with inside the smallpox vaccine, and cowpox virus. The first human case of monkeypox was recorded in the Democratic Republic of the Congo, DRC, in 1970 during a period of intense efforts to eradicate smallpox. Since then, monkeypox has been reported to humans in several other Central and West African countries, including Cameroon, the Central African Republic, Côte d'Ivoire, the Democratic Republic of the Congo, Gabon, Liberia, Nigeria, the Republic of the Congo, and Sierra Leone. Most infectious diseases are in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Cases of human monkeypox occur outside of Africa in connection with overseas travel and imported animals, including cases in the United States, Israel, Singapore, and the United Kingdom. The natural reservoir of monkeypox remains unknown. However, rodents in Africa and non-human primates, such as monkeys, can hide the virus and infect humans. In humans, the symptoms of monkeypox are similar to those of smallpox, but mild. Monkeypox begins with fever, headache, muscle aches, and malaise. The main difference between the symptoms of smallpox and monkeypox is that smallpox causes swelling of the lymph nodes, lymphadenopathy, but smallpox does not. The incubation period, time from infection to symptoms, of monkeypox is usually 7 to 14 days, but can range from 5 to 21 days. Fever, headache, muscle aches, backache, swollen lymph nodes, chills and exhaustion are the indication and symptoms and within one to three days or sometimes longer after the appearance of fever, the patient develops a rash, often on the face then spreading to other parts of the body. Lesions go through the following steps before shedding. Dirt, papules, vesicles, acne, scab. The illness usually lasts two to four weeks. In Africa, Monkeypox has been shown to kill 1 in 10 people who get sick. Transmission The monkeypox virus can spread when a person comes into contact with a virus from an infected animal, person, or a substance contaminated with the virus. The virus can also cross the placenta from mother to fetus. The monkeypox virus can be transmitted from animals to humans by being bitten or scratched by infected animals, handling wild animals, or using products made from infected animals. The virus can also spread through direct contact with the infected person's body fluids and wounds or with substances that come into contact with body fluids or wounds such as clothing or bedding. Monkeypox spreads among people primarily through infectious wounds, scabs, or direct contact with body fluids. It can also spread through respiratory secretions with prolonged face-to-face contact. Monkeypox can spread through intimate contact between people, including during sex, and through activities such as kissing, hugging, or touching parts of the body with monkeypox wounds. It is currently unknown whether monkeypox can spread through semen or vaginal fluid. Some scientists have recently issued a research as sperm being a carrier in June 2022 in Europe. It is suspected that rodents in Africa play a role in infecting humans with monkeypox, but it is not yet known which animals maintain the virus in nature. Prevention There are a number of measures that can be taken to prevent infection with monkeypox virus. Avoid contact with animals that could harbor the virus, including animals that are sick or that have been found dead in areas where monkeypox occurs. 
Avoid contact with any materials, such as bedding, that has been in contact with a sick animal. Isolate infected patients from others who could be at risk for infection. Practice good hand hygiene after contact with infected animals or humans. For example, washing your hands with soap and water or using an alcohol-based hand sanitizer. Use personal protective equipment, PPE, when caring for the patient. Giniasm, also known as Imbimune or Imbinex, is a live attenuated virus vaccine distributed in the United States. Approved by the Food and Drug Administration for the Prevention of Monkeypox. The Advisory Committee on Immunization and Implementation, ACIP, is currently evaluating Giniasm to protect individuals at risk of occupational exposure to the orthopox virus, such as smallpox and monkeypox, in a preventative environment. Clinical Guidance for the Treatment of Monkeypox Many individuals infected with monkeypox virus have a mild, self-limiting disease course in the absence of specific therapy. However, the prognosis for monkeypox depends on multiple factors such as previous vaccination status, initial health status, concurrent illnesses, and comorbidities among others. Persons who should be considered for treatment following consultation with CDC might include persons with severe disease, for example, hemorrhagic disease, confluent lesions, sepsis, encephalitis, or other conditions requiring hospitalization. Persons who may be at high risk of severe disease, or persons with immunocompromise, for example, human immunodeficiency virus slash acquired immune deficiency syndrome infection, leukemia, lymphoma, generalized malignancy, solid organ transplantation, therapy with alkylating agents, antimetabolites, radiation, tumor necrosis factor inhibitors, high-dose corticosteroids, being a recipient with hematopoietic stem cell transplant less than 24 months post-transplant or greater than or equal to 24 months. But with graft versus disease or disease relapse, or having autoimmune disease with immunodeficiency as a clinical component 1. Pediatric populations, particularly patients younger than 8 years of age 2 O pregnant or breastfeeding women 3 O persons with one or more complications, for example, secondary bacterial skin infection, gastroenteritis with severe nausea slash vomiting, diarrhea or dehydration, bronchopneumonia, concurrent disease or other comorbidities for persons with monkeypox virus aberrant infections that include its accidental implantation in eyes, mouth, or other anatomical areas where monkeypox virus infection might constitute a special hazard, for example, the genitals or anus. Currently, there is no specific treatment approved for monkeypox virus infection. However, antiviral drugs developed for use in patients with smallpox may prove beneficial. The following medical measures are currently available from the Strategic National Stockpile, SNS, as an option to treat monkeypox. Tecovirumab, also known as T-pox, is an antiviral drug approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, FDA. External icon for the treatment of human smallpox in 100 adult and pediatric patients weighs at least 3 kg. The CDC has an extended access investigational drug protocol, EIND, that allows tecovilamate to be used to treat non-variola orthopox viruses, including monkeypox, at the time of outbreak. This protocol includes permission to open one tecobilamate oral capsule and mix its contents with a semi-solid food for pediatric patients weighing less than 13 kg. Tecovirumab can be used for oral, 200 mg capsules, and intravenous injections. Sidofovir, also known as Vistide, is an FDA-approved antiviral drug. The CDC has eind, which can be used to treat orthopox viruses, including monkeypox, during outbreaks using Sidofovir. Vaccinia immunoglobulin intravenous, BIGIV, to the FDA for the treatment of complications associated with vaccinia vaccination, including vaccinia eczema, progressive vaccinia, severe systemic vaccinia, vaccinia infections in individuals with skin disorders, and abnormal infections with a vaccinia virus approved. Except for solitary keratitis. The CDC is retained and EI and allows VIGIF to be used to treat orthopox viruses, including monkeypox, at the time of outbreak. Brinsidefover, also known as Tempexa, is an antiviral drug approved by the FDA on June 4, 2021. External icon for the treatment of human smallpox disease in adult and pediatric patients, including newborns. 
The CDC is developing EIND, which facilitates the use of Brinsidefovir to treat monkeypox. However, Brinsidefovir is currently not available on social media. Information for clinicians The first symptoms of monkeypox are fever, malaise, headache, and sometimes sore throat and cough. A distinguishing feature of monkeypox and smallpox is lymphadenopathy, swelling of the lymph nodes. This is usually the onset of fever, one to two days before the onset of the rash, or the onset of the rash is rare. Lymph nodes can swell in the neck, submandibular glands and neck, armpits, axilla, or groin, groin, and appear on both sides or only one side of the body. Information for laboratory personnel. When testing routine clinical specimens from patients with confirmed or suspected monkeypox, measures should be taken to minimize the risk of infection in the laboratory. This includes limiting the number of test samples for staff, wearing appropriate personal protective equipment, using strictly applied standard precautions, and avoiding procedures that may produce infectious aerosols. Information for veterinarians Veterinarians need to consider all mammals that are susceptible to monkeypox and know how the disease is transmitted from animal to animal. Veterinarians who decide to treat animals with suspected monkeypox should take infection control precautions to protect themselves, staff, customers, and other animal patients at the clinic.